touch. Go on, Tanner. International break is finally over, of course. Of course, getting that fab 2-0 win against Latvia. However, today is the big one. And at last, it is at home first as well. It just seems like forever since we've actually played the first game at home. Goes without saying that we have to get all three points today. Everyone knows about it. I'm not going to go into it. Our record over the last 10 years in this fixture has been absolutely unacceptable. The last time I've actually seen us beat them lot live, I was 11. I'm now in my 20s. It's ridiculous, but honestly, I feel confident today going into it. I'm not going to jinx it much. I'm not going to say much because I don't want to go in the wrong way, of course. But with the way that Errol Bullet has started as well, especially especially with the goals we, we are now finally scoring is a breath of fresh air and it's something... And it's something that we really needed last season, but we just couldn't do. Hopefully, we have shored up our defence within the last 20 minutes as we are we have been bottling so many leads as of late. Leicester, Leeds, um, also got to mention that Ipswich game as well, but nothing more to say apart from that. I don't want to jinx it. And yeah, let's do it. Thoughts on today then? Another South Wales derby. Yeah, nervous. Um, yeah, as you say, we keep shooting ourselves in the foot. We, we play well for what, like 45, 60 minutes and then, especially that Ipswich game, we look absolutely fantastic playing some brilliant stuff. And then we, we just throw it away and lose 3-2. Um, at home, we haven't been actually playing that well. Well, have we? QPR match was terrible. Shocking. Sheffield Wednesday, we needed a penalty. Practically the last kick of the match to win that one. So, um, yeah, a little bit nervous. A lot of confidence throughout the... Uh, the supporters though at Cardiff but uh, that worries me, me a bit but we are playing in the night and and I think under the lights at the Cardiff City Stadium it'll, the, the atmosphere will go up a notch or two and uh, hopefully the, 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 the fans they've been in the, in the pubs of Canton and Cardiff this afternoon and hopefully they haven't uh, peaked too soon with their singing and everything and uh, we carry on throughout the 90 minutes and please 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 players Let's have a performance for 90 minutes and some goals because we know we can score them now.
Justin. Outside trap. Set, set. Unlucky. Come on. I need to be taking them. Come on. Come on, the shaping is stunning. Swansea get battered everywhere they go. Swansea get battered everywhere they go. In ball, come on. Ref! He took the play out. Show the lobby there. Oh, yeah! With a little pick and show the lobby there. Come on. Back on to glory. This will ever be your story. Keep this birdie words big for you. Rushman will not yield. 
from the hills rebounding. Let this world cry shouting. Summon all the Cabris call, the mighty force surrounding. Men of honour called to glory, this will ever be your story. Set it! Come on, boys. Go on, Yak! Oh, oh my God! Oh, what a save. That's the end of the first half, nil-nil. Probably the first time in ages has been nil-nil at half time, considering our performances, but probably one of the most cagiest games I've seen probably ever. Like everyone's nervous to go forward, the chances we've had we haven't taken. Um, we've lost the ball a lot as well. They're a bit cagey going forwards, but at times they look as if they're just gonna absolutely shred us to pieces, which does worry me a lot. But I think we'll benefit us the second half being in front of the canton. Uh, atmosphere of course has been phenomenal but we just whoever gets a goal now for me wins it it's, it, it's either going to be a nil nil or a one nil literally um just cagey 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 but as far as i'm concerned touch wood we can suck a goal in from the amazing sport of the canton but come on boys we need to iron out the mistakes a few uh, individual performances do concern me a little bit as well but apart from that come on what do you think yeah it's so tight isn't it it's Nobody wants to make a mistake. We'll see that. First 45 minutes, hopefully, all come out. Second 45 minutes, all guns blazing. We need to get Ramsey on the ball. Or Siopis is looking good. Colin Grant in and out of the game. But uh, yeah, either. both teams really haven't been te haven't tested the, the opposition keeper. So uh, hopefully, I'll open up a little bit second half and uh, yeah, see if, if we can get a goal then. Uh, it, it could be all over there. Totally forgot the first half. <laughs> in the death, made his chance, and he's almost scored the game at the beginning of the second half. Oh! Oh, come on! 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 Oh my God! Oh, what a save that is! A free chance. Come on! Calon. Shoot. Lovely. Rambo. Oh my god. Shoot, Calon. You're in the wrong position, for God's sake. Oh my god. Chance of the game right there. Ref. There we go. Touch. Go on, Tanner. Yeah.
everywhere they go. Swansea get battered everywhere they go. Everywhere they go. Swansea get battered everywhere they go. Swansea get battered everywhere they go.
What a goal by Oli Tanner. What a sneaky penalty by Super Aaron Ramsey. 2 0. Absolutely incredible. Barely getting my breath back after that. Out of, but even out of both of the promotions, I've got to say that is the loudest and best I've ever heard the Cardiff City Stadium. Probably the closest we'll ever get to Ninian Park as well. It brought back the memories, especially of those great wings and the atmosphere at Ninian Park. Absolutely phenomenal. What do you think? Yeah, it was a phenomenal atmosphere. However, I think the Leicester in the playoff semi-final uh, is still the best one I've ever been to but at the, uh, at, uh, the Cardiff City Stadium. But uh, Oli Tanner coming on, totally changed the game. I think it was his sort of first passage of play where he sort of skipped inside and slotted the ball into the far corner. Keeper had no chance. And then uh, it was Tanner again driving into the boxes he, he's so direct isn't he and uh, he was just taken out and Ramsey coolly slotted the ball again and it was very similar to the the goal that Ramsey or the penalty that Ramsey slotted past the Latvian keeper last week so phenomenal victory phenomenal atmosphere we've got Coventry on Tuesday evening hopefully we'll be able to take that into it whether Ramsey's available for that because he, he was out on his feet could hardly walk at the end taken off of course wasn't he but uh, yeah 
brilliant. Every single player, second half especially, worked their socks off. Thoroughly deserved it. There was times where they could probably manage it a little bit better. Maybe run to the corner it's in the last five minutes with the ball. Because Swansea had a couple of opportunities, didn't they? Right they did. at the death. And it could have been really nervous if they did put one of them away. But uh, overall, thoroughly deserved the victory. And uh, yeah, everybody goes happy from Cardiff on, on this Saturday evening now. So uh, yeah, roll on Tuesday. Hopefully we can get all three points again. But uh, you know, absolutely phenomenal result and uh, we deserved it. And I don't think Swansea could replicate an atmosphere like that, that at their ground. However no chance. loud they think, they, they, you know, this is a special club compared to that Tim Pot, uh, Tim Pot uh, club down the, down the road. But uh, we'll see what happens and uh, maybe that'll come back to bite me uh, later this season. But, uh, we'll yeah, see. ignore the camera quality. I'm not sure what's happened with it. There we go. It's gone very blurry for some reason, but... Yeah, absolutely phenomenal. For me, this has kick-started our season now. Yeah, we needed it. If three points especially, we needed that. Totally needed those three points. 100%, and we can really kick on from here now. And arrow bullets, barmy on me. Ah, oh, just phenomenal. But if you have enjoyed it, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, do what you can, support the channel. That'd be appreciated. Follow us on social medias, and I'll see you all on Tuesday night for Coventry. Beers now, is it? Oh, yes, 100%. Hoyle Bauer.